All right, it's time to join the top or joint the top. Now this is traditionally done with a hand plane, but usually it's done using a shooting board and the plane actually moves while the wood remains still. Uh, but I saw this way of doing it and uh, on a channel called I think Nelson's Guitars. Uh, I'll try to put a link down below to the video. Uh, and I thought it would be simpler to do because I have tried to do this a couple of times. I, I've replaced uh, guitar tops and I have uh, actually built like a semi-acoustic electric kind of guitar. And But both times I had to joint a top. And I've tried with this hand plane. Uh, and I never can quite seem to get it. I always have to, to go back to like a sanding beam or sandpaper on a flat surface in order to get it right. Uh, but the fundamental idea is that you uh, joint it by running it along or running a plane along the edge until you get a flat surface that mates together. You see I've got both of the pieces of the soundboard taped together so that when I cut that line I'm cutting both of them at the same time. And it's a slow process, but you got to be careful because what I ended up doing the last couple of times, well, one time I ended up taking so much off of it that the board wasn't wide enough and I had to order another top and start over. So you have to be careful with that. And now you see me, I'm taking off the tape because what I'm going to do And you'll see me do it here in a minute. I'm going to walk over where I know there's plenty of sunlight and put the two pieces of wood together. And here you see me doing it. Uh, and do what's known as candling. And you hold the pieces together and look down that seam and look and see if there's any light showing. If there's any light showing, the joint is not good enough. And you have to go back to the plank. Now, this is the third time I've tried to do this. I did not uh, find success with this method this time around. I still had to go back to uh, actually some sandpaper uh, mounted to my table saw uh, top that I know is flat in order to get this seam, both this seam and the uh, back plates uh, and I won't show doing the back it's the same process but yeah I'm still working on trying to get it right uh, with a plane uh, when you have such thin pieces of wood it's a lot more difficult to do so uh, that's what I ended up having to do is go back to a sanding beam uh, a flat sanding surface until I got the joint where I wanted. So uh, with that said, this is the process and we're going to move on now to actually joining the top. All right, we're ready to join the top. This is a rig that I borrowed from Kathy Matsushita, I think is her name. She's got a uh, an amateur website uh, on building guitars. And uh, it's really simple. I have five nails here and a couple of nails to register these two plates. This is a three quarter piece of plywood. And uh, I have about a five sixteenths thick piece of wood here and this is to keep glue from sticking to it. And what I'll do the way this works, get some of that 
sawdust out of there is you set this like this and hold it up against there like this and then what I'll do is drive five nails into this other side opposite of those watch it be careful you don't hit the soundboard like I did it's the edge so it'll be all right but still Make sure they're down there good. And then what I'll do is take one edge of this and put some glue along it. My hands are trembling like a big dog. So you'll have to excuse me. I want to uh, clean this off. Anyway. pieces together, placing, hands are trembling, it's shaking, I'm having a hard time doing this for some reason, but that's alright, and then basically you're going to pull that out and press it down. Actually, I want that to go like that. Press it down. Now the glue squeeze out. And what I'm going to do, take this board
and that's down as good as I can get it and I'm going to take this board now Make sure these ends are down because I don't want it to cup. There you are. What I'm going to do is I'm going to weigh that center seam down a bit. And there, that's done. Have to let it dry, and uh, and it, it's joined. I'll do the back the same way. I may or may not sh show that, but I'll do the back the same way. Thanks for watching. Later.